Artifact Course Class 2. Artifacts are structures in ultrasound that are not real, you cannot see, are not in the good location, or have no the correct brine shape or size. Artifacts are not real. But sometimes the complexity of the machine and the ultrasound don't let you know exactly what was the reason of artifact. Sometimes it's the mix of two different causes. Limitations of ultrasound sampling process and improper work of the machine are sometimes the cause of ultrasound artifacts. What is assumption? Assumption is something that you believe is true. It's something that you suppose is granted, but sometimes don't happen. Certain assumptions are necessary to produce the picture but even sometimes are not true and this is for what artifact was produced. When these assumptions are erroneous, artifacts are produced. One of the first assumptions is the ultrasound go along a straight line not always ultrasound go astray. Second is the attenuation depend of the deep the structure is. Not always the attenuation depend of the deep. Also depend of the structure that are in the soft tissue. The dimension of the beam are only two, that not three. The ultrasound beam have three dimensions: sagittal axial resolution, lateral resolution, and elevational resolution. That is a dimension that is not in the picture, but produce artifacts. All the echoes are originated from the axis of the beam only. That is not always true because sometimes the ultrasound transducer produces ultrasound that is outside the beam and also produce echoes. All the echoes are coming from the last pulse that is not always true. Sometimes coming echoes that are not produced by the last pulse. The ultrasound propagation speed is 1540 meters by second always. 1540 meters by second is the average in soft tissue. Not always is the propagation speed of ultrasound. Each reflector produces only one echo. That is not always true. Sometimes the reflector remains vibrating and produces more than one echo. This is something that the machine cannot understand. The assumption is each reflector only one echo but this is something that not always happens. The amplitude of the echo depends on the object. It's only related with the properties of the object. Not always that is true. Depend of the time gain compensation. Depend of the focal area. There are some artifacts that are dependent on the technique. This is depend on the quality or the experience of the transducer. 
too much gain, no good time gain compensations are something that produce artifacts and are depending of the quality of the work. Here you can see two pictures, the left picture has too much gain. Low signal caused by inappropriate transducer selection or low gain setting. In this case, you can see the time gain compensation is very low in the deep areas and you cannot see the parenchyma of the liver in the deeper areas. But time gain compensations can produce artifacts. The first one that is more related, not with the technician, is about assumption of the machine. Attenuation of ultrasound is constant in soft tissue. Attenuation of some tissue is not uniform, depend of the structures that are in the soft tissue. This is the definition of attenuation, is the normal weakening of the sound wave as it travels in a medium. The units are decibels, and is determined by the frequency of the sound. We know more is the frequency of ultrasound, more is the attenuation and also by the distance that the sound travels. More deep are the structure, less amplitude have the echoes. In other words, deeper structures have more attenuated ultrasound echoes. More frequency, more attenuation.